if you live in the 70 mile zone of the August eclipse, you better brace yourself for an impact of 7.5 million people predicted to travel to these small towns where they are just not set up for that many people. So what does that mean? Hmm. Well, it means cell phone outages because too many people trying to use their cell phones. It means nowhere to stay because everywhere will be booked up. It means shortage, shortages of water and food because again, these small towns are not set up. They're not ready. They cannot house and feed and give all these resources to that many people, okay? There's just no way it's gonna happen because what's gonna happen, like I said, everything's gonna fill up, there'll be nowhere to stay, all the food's gonna run out. And so I'm just warning you people out there, if you live in one of these small towns, cities, whatever, you better stock up on food and water because all these people are gonna invade on your towns and they're gonna be needing places to stay, they're gonna be needing food, they're gonna be using the internet, your internet's gonna crash. I myself actually am having a landline line installed because I'm, I'm about, I would say, oh, 100 miles from the 70 mile, the 70 mile zone. So I'm afraid that a lot of people are going to flock to where I live too, because what they'll do is they'll still camp, they'll get a hotel here and then they're going to drive up there. So I'm getting ready because I don't want to have no cell phone down, you know, for days and days. I mean, who knows, they could get here early you know, a week early and start using everything and everything's going to run out and it's going to be hard to get online or impossible. Things will crash. And yeah, because, you know, you can't, you can't just have all these people flock to your cities and towns and expect everything to run as normal. Oh, besides that traffic jams, major, major traffic jams. So, yep. Just warning you people, I will put a link uh, in the description box below. Take care.